and painting your bathroom. Now, I used a nice beige trim and I painted a little row of flowers up near the ceiling. Oh, that's so sweet. Mm. Thanks, Lou. Sure. Oh, um, I wouldn't go in there for a couple hours because, you know, paint fumes. Oh, all right. So I will just use the one down here. Yeah, sure. Mi casa, su casa. <laughs> now, boys, you're about to discover one of the main differences between men and women. In four, three, two, <gasps> Oh, my God. That is the most disgusting bathroom I have ever seen. It is covered with grease and oil and slime, and the sink is leaking. You know, it reminds me of that pit from Silence of the Lambs. Oh. <laughs> well, what about the customers? I mean, don't they ask to use it? Just once. <laughs> like to go back there and clean up that bathroom for me, huh? Oh, Joe, what would I do with a million dollars? Because that's what I charge to clean the gateway to hell. <laughs> nah, it is not that bad. Why don't you clean it up then? Because I may want to have children one day, that's all. Hey, Joe. Matt, heads up. Oh, wow, bad outfit. <laughs> Are you trying to tell me something? No. It's only going to be the hottest band in the country. It's like the third CD you've given me this week. Well, you know, I'd get a great discount at the store. Hey, kid, got something for you, too. Barney Unplugged. You know, you have the greatest job. Well, you know they're hiring right now down at the record store. Why don't you come with me and I'll introduce you to my boss, Damon. Well, that sounds great. Although I don't know a lot about music. Oh, you don't have to. You just have to look cute and act like you know what you're talking about. <laughs> Works for Barney. <laughs> So, what do you think? It's pretty cool, huh? You get to listen to music all day long, and you get paid for it. Yep, it's totally out of control. <laughs> Look, that's Damon. You're gonna love him. He's 28, but he acts way young. Why don't you check out the store, and I'll go get him. Excuse me. Um, I'm trying to find a CD for my friend. Do you know anything about this one? Um, yeah, it's, um, it's Power Pop. Sounds like Seattle. It's not for everyone, but you look like you could handle it. Oh, cool. Yeah. Thanks, I'll take it. Hi, I'm Damon. Hey. I like the way you book, uh, sold that CD. <laughs> you ever hear this band? No. You never will. There's a place for CDs like this, the bin at the car wash. So if you can sell this, I've got a position open. Great, when can I start? You started five minutes ago when you sold that CD. <laughs> How's that sound? Well, that sounds great, sir. I Lose the sir. It's a record store, not a boot camp. <laughs> but if you want, you can drop and give me 20. I'm kidding. <laughs> All right, Lloyd, I called 20 plumbers. Finally found one that will come over and fix the leak. He is on his way. <laughs> plumbers, huh? Mechanic wannabes. <laughs> Anything a plumber can do, a mechanic can do better. And without the auto mechanic, the world would not go. Without the plumber, the world wouldn't go either. Fine. If you're comfortable giving your money to some sludge-covered, knuckle-dragging plunger jockey, that's your business. Hello. I'm Chip from Pipe Masters, the can-do plumbers. I have an 1117 appointment with a non-sealing receptacle. Actually, we just got a leaky sink back there. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Your mechanics. I'll have to use layman's terms. Where's the big drip? <laughs> How dare you, sir? Oh, Lloyd. Mm -hmm. Wait a minute. The malfunction is in this garage? Yeah. See ya. Wait a minute, wait a minute. <laughs> Where were you going? No one said that this was an industrial facility. But you haven't even seen the bathroom yet. You don't need to see the Taj Mahal to know that it smells like curry. <laughs> yes. 
We are mechanics. It's a little on the greasy side in here, but come on. I'm sure it's nothing you haven't seen before. I mean, you could do this. Come on, Chip. You could do it. It's not that bad. I mean, after all, you're the uh, can-do plumbers. No can-do. Wait a minute. All right, wait. You know, I call every plumber in town. All right. If you mop up your mess... I can squeeze you in between a cold jacuzzi and a leaky bidet on Tuesday. Would that make you happy? As long as you're not talking literally, yes. We don't have to clean our bathroom to satisfy some plumber. Hmm. Let's think about that. Yes, you're right. See ya. Okay, all right, all right. Tuesday, okay? It'll be spotless. I'll be the judge of that. I'll be the judge of that. Can help me carry this out to your car? It being heavy metal and all. <laughs> it's just a little record store humor. <laughs> oh, you know what? Uh, excuse me, sir. Um, you gave me a 50, not a 20. I'm sorry. Hey, man, you got a second? Sure. Look, I'm sorry about that, right? I honestly thought he gave me a 20. Hey, man, don't sweat it. We all make mistakes. You'd be surprised at how many kids would have pocketed the change. But I can see that you're a really honest kid, though. Thanks. So do me a favor. Keep your eyes open. There have been a couple of things missing. Really? What? <laughs> uh, CDs and tapes. Those being the only things we sell. <laughs> oh! <laughs> you know that heavy metal joke you've been saying since you got here? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Don't do that. I got it. So, what was that all about? Damon thinks somebody might be stealing. He didn't say anything about me, did he? No, why? No, no reason. Kristen, tell me you're not stealing. Come on, lighten up. It's just a few here and there. It's like working at a hamburger joint and eating a few fries. Yeah, but at the end of the night, the fries are considered garbage. <laughs> and have you heard some of the stuff we're selling? Come on, Matt, don't be so naive. Everybody does it. I can't believe you'd steal. We get a great discount. You were the one who told me what a great job this was. All right, all right, all right. I won't do it anymore. You've got a customer. <sighs> so you're telling me that even the plumber wouldn't go into that bathroom? Well, this was, uh, this was an unusually clean plumber. Uh-huh. <laughs> I guess you and Lloyd have to face the music. Well, you